everybody. I'm Don Koss, your host for Big Time Wrestling. Today, main event, we got it right here. Look at this. Rip Oliver teaming up with Abuda Dean to go against Brady Boone and Scott Doring. And there's more action where that came from, too. We've got news for you, interviews, and, of course, all the action right after this timeout. From my friend to the arena, Big Time Wrestling about to explode all over your television set. Don Owen will make the announcement of our first match today. Ladies and gentlemen, the next event will be one fall. Introducing in this corner, 236 pounds from North Carolina, Stony Burke. His opponent in this corner, 228 pounds from the South Pacific, Tama Samoa. Thank you. <coughs> Took a drink of water here and it <coughs> went down the wrong pipe. Or two or three wrong pipes. Oh, I'll tell you, it just kind of chokes you up to see all the action out there. <coughs> yeah, I should have been a plumber. Oh, Stony Burke. Tama Samoa wrestling barefooted. This should be a scientific good sportsmanship type match. But that will be remaining to be seen. And we're seeing it right now. And referee, NWA referee Sandy Barr presiding over the action. And will attempt to keep it good sportsmanship if he possibly can. Thomas Samoa is a man who. Uh, as a professional wrestler has just absolutely been improving day after day, week after week since he's been here in the Northwest. A very popular pro wrestler everywhere he goes in every city throughout the entire area throughout Washington, Oregon and every town they're in. And they're in a bunch of them, my friends, when big time wrestling comes to your town. Take the whole family out there. Really enjoy. Good crowd here in the arena today. A lot of folks brought their own homemade signs and banners. And boy, they've got them all over the place, including a bunch of cameras, too. Tama Samoa, of course, giving up quite a bit of height and weight to uh, Stony Burke. But Tama brings a brand of action pro wrestling into the ring that is very amazing. And he makes up in athletic ability and agility what he may lack in size with any opponent. Side headlock by Stony Burke on Tama Samoa and against the ropes. And now Stony Burke into the ropes. Oh, and a shoulder tackle by Stony. Down goes Tama Samoa. Over goes Stony again. And leg trip to take down by Thomas Samoa on Stony Burke. Are you ready for some information on our next extravaganzas? Don Owen putting together an extravaganza in Seattle on Wednesday, September the 24th, and in Spokane on Thursday, September the 25th. Seattle's will be at the Seattle Center. And Spokane's will be at the Spokane Coliseum. Sergeant Slaughter, as you know, has already been signed up because the Sarge, in a phone call to Don Owen, requested, or actually demanded, to be on this extravaganza card. And he wanted a Budadine. He wants the Arab. He wants a war out there in the middle of the ring, and that's exactly what is going to happen. Don Owen said, you got it, Sarge. It's going to be Sergeant Slaughter and Abuda Dean in those extravaganzas. And we just found out that the Road Warriors have been signed for the extravaganza. So it's going to be the Road Warriors on that card. And it's going to be Sergeant Slaughter on that card. Boy, you're going to... Next week, we will give you all the information on uh, 
on tickets. But that is going to be some kind of an extravaganza. It's been a while since Don Owen has had one, and now he's got one in Seattle on Wednesday the 24th and in Spokane on Thursday the 25th. This is our first match today on Big Time Wrestling. You're watching Stoney Burke and Thomas Samoa grappling out there in the middle of the ring and it's Thomas Samoa getting a one count on Stoney Burke. A lot of folks still asking uh, for more information on the uh, pro wrestling newspaper that is out now in the Northwest called Wrestle Media. And I've got an address that you can write to for a copy or for information. The name of the newspaper is Northwest Wrestle Media. It has stories and photos and interviews on all the wrestlers that you see on Big Time Wrestling. And here is the Here's the address, Wrestle Media. Post Office Box 17202, Portland, Oregon, 97217. Wrestle Media, right? Drop them a line. Speaking of dropping a line, those you folks watching us right now, Big Time Wrestling on KTZZ, Channel 22. In the city of Seattle. We thank you so much. Drop those folks a line, will you? Drop KTZZ a line and tell them you watch big time wrestling every Saturday. And of course, you folks over in Spokane, in the Inland Empire, why, thanks to the good people at Cox Cable, you're watching big time wrestling every Tuesday and Thursday on Cox Cable in Spokane. And we're certainly glad to have you folks along, too. You might drop, uh, drop Cox Cable a line and uh, tell them you watch Big Time Wrestling and that you really enjoy it every week. And I believe that the man to ask for it or to, to write your letter to is, uh, is Mon Mr. Monday. Is that it, uh, Larry? Yeah, miss just... Just address it to Mr. Monday at Cox Cable. Head scissors by Stony Burke on Thomas Samoa. Thomas Samoa slamming his bare feet down on that mat. You can hear it splat clear. They're around the building. And now, Thomas Samoa. Kind of turning the tables on Stony Burke. He's got those legs crossed. Applying a good deal of pressure and pain, obviously. To Stony. One, two, and boy, Stony kicked out of that just in the nick of time. Both men lock up again. This time a hammerlock by Thomas Samoa on Stony Burke. Hit toss by Tama and Stony powers out of that. Relatively easy. We've got so many things going on all over the Northwest. Grudge matches, feuds, riots. <laughs> so you name it. That feud between Rip Oliver and Coco Samoa. I don't know if that'll ever end. It just seems to get hotter every week. Pendleton, Oregon, coming your way Sunday, August the 17th. That's tomorrow. 8 p.m. Rip Oliver's going to be on that card. Coco Samoa on the card. We're going to have a loggers match, I understand. With guards around the ring with leather straps. Now, these guys are going to have leather straps to keep both men in the ring. It's going to be Rip Oliver... Coco Samoa with guards around the ring. It's going to be a loggers match. 
That's going to be one of the wildest things that Pendleton has seen in a long time, if possibly ever. At the Armory, starting at 8 o'clock, get your tickets now. Club Cigar Store. That's where you can get your tickets. Well, they had a near riot there last time. I'm sure that tomorrow will there'll be another screecher over there in Pendleton. Into the ropes goes Thomas Samoa and body slam by Stony Burke. Kickoff by Samoa. And arm drag by Thomas Samoa. See that we're going to be in Ellensburg, Washington on Friday, August the 29th. Big time wrestling coming to the one and only Ellensburg Fair and Rodeo with a big 10 man over the top battle royal for a $2,000 prize going to the last man left in the ring. Now, if you think the world-famous rodeo is wild, uh -huh, uh -huh. wait till you see the Battle Royal there. That's in Ellensburg. Plus, they're going to have five other bouts there. Rip Oliver's going to be there, Mean Mike, Abuda Dean, entire clan, Coco, Ricky Santana, of course, Brady Boone, Scott Dora, they'll all be there. One, two, and he's got him for a three count. Oh, boy, look at that. Thomas Samoa. Yeah, I told you he has a way of making up for lack of uh, height and weight. Thomas Samoa with tremendous athletic ability getting the pin on Stoney Burke. Thomas, the winner over Stoney in our first match. We'll be back with more after this timeout. 